Okay, you can say hello again now. No. I hadn't actually started Hello. Yet. <laughs> there's not like a light that goes off that says, I'm recording. It beeps. But there's no light on the front. You can listen for the beep. There's a light in the back that says, I'm recording. Yeah, I can't see that. <laughs> mm. Anyway, so what we're at now is we have threaded all the threads, um, one, one of each set, through the uh, little holes. Mm. So now... We take about an inch worth at a time, so then this would be, you know, this is a 10 inch handle, like I said before, or 10 dent handle. So it's 10 per inch, so I'm going to have 5 up and 5 down. And I'm going to tie them onto the dowel. And the easiest way, I thought we had to tie them like one at a time, it was such a pain. But the easiest way is to take 5 at a time, and, um, you know, it wasn't necessarily stated exactly where I should do this. I found it in a book, like in a margin somewhere. But you loop over and do an overhand knot. You come back. I'm going to take up some slack because I'm going to get a lot of slack here in a minute. And so you have this like this, and then you take that and then you tie it like so. And it takes a little finagling, finagling sometimes. <laughs> Once I get on a roll, I'm usually pretty good. But, okay, so you tie one end. Don't tie them super tight because there's a lot of slack inside this roll. So the, the more you tighten it, the more slack comes off that roll. It's easier just to tie them all kind of loose and then tighten it so all the slack comes out. Then tighten each one. Make sure they're uniform. And do then it again. You roll and then do, then do it again. again. And do it again. And do it again. And it's so a pain. So now you're, you're, you're doing it. Um, I'm alternating. You're alternating sides so that this uh, the so. dowel doesn't get too wonky. Flopsy. Yeah. Am I on your way here? A little bit. I can move. I can move. Move back to Kansas where you came from. What? You do Google Kansas. Topeka. Are they still Topeka? I don't know. It was probably just for April Fool's. You probably wonder... 20 years from now. Why was he saying Topeka? It was an April Fool's gag, if you remember what April Fool's once was. Okay, now you're telling us, so now we won't be curious anymore. Well, I hate being, you're I hate, like, ruining not the knowing. Surprise. What the heck was I thinking, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Happens too often during the day, huh? <laughs> yes, all the time. I'm so mean. You're horrible to me. But no, I, I could be mean. I could be like, every time I look at you, I wonder what I was thinking. <laughs> And you'd be like, every time I look at you, I think of Edward. <laughs> That's You're only saying that because this is going to be given to Maggie at some point, probably. Probably. Nobody else knows who Edward is. They might think it's your ex-boyfriend. <laughs> Ew. Ew. You never get the sparkles out. What? <laughs> of the carpet. Of anything. Ew. <laughs> Now, if you want, you can actually do four at a time, or, you know, since you have a 12-dent heddle, you probably want to do, you know, maybe even, you know, six at a time if you want to do yeah. a little bit more control over the number of ends you have. Um, but, you know, usually if you, you know, don't do more than an inch at a time, you'll be fine. me holding on the end of it. If you want to. I feel like I need to be more involved and just... You're the camera person. You never see camera people involved. Yeah, you do. When? You see them in, in dirty jobs all the time. You're making fun of each other. You mostly might make fun of everybody else, but... This is job. That's my job. I'm the host. Oh, yeah. I this is the host. I get to make fun of the cameraman as the cameraman breaks camera equipment and knocks over important expensive pieces of equipment. Don't push me. I'm trying to make, you know... Make good TV? Yes. And then we can videotape the aftermath. So this is what happens when you push your camera woman over. <laughs> so anyways, I guess I don't need to watch the whole thing, but this is what we're doing. One Do you have anything else to say? Yes. One very important <laughs> thing is that after you get it kind of secure here, when you start tying the rest of them, 
and you can start tightening it because the way these knots work nicely is that you know you can make them tighter by by pulling on the ends and shifting them back you know like for example though you'll see them get like that but I'm not gonna pull them real tight here because then I'm just gonna have to tighten them all later but actually the heddle needs to be in the up position so because that's because when you have this Toads are opposite of where they should be. It's because when you have this, what's actually going to happen? When you're tightening it, you mean? <laughs> what's that? <laughs> That's what I have to hold when you're doing this. I have yes. to hold the heddle. I forgot about that. I know I had to hold something. I thought I was supposed to hold the dowel. I'm so smart. But what happens here is that you actually need the head on the up position because these threads are a little bit longer these pieces of yarn are a little bit longer than the ones down here and if you don't do that you'll notice when you weave this these top will be so wicked tight you won't be able to move the head up and down and these will be really really loose and it's really annoying because then you get the bottom part if you part notice, you notice how much the bottom moves even though he's only just He's only and tight, them, and those don't move barely at all. It's hard to, they're wicked tight compared to yeah, this. Right, you're, you're falling down on the job. I know, sorry, I'm holding it. <laughs> what? Do, 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 do. Anyways, do, 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 do. this is this is hurting my hand now, holding the camera only one-handed the whole time. So, um, is there anything else you want to say for in this segment? Um, after these messages, we'll be right back.